2020 was a bad year for me financially on RuneScape. The year started off by me dying on my hardcore Iron Man, meaning I had to give away the 1 billion GP bounty to my community, which I also did. And ever since this day, I have never really recovered financially on RuneScape, and I need 500 mil GP to be able to afford a Twisted Bow in-game, and this Twisted Bow is something I really need for future content. I started off doing some free-for-all raids, just testing my luck here, and from the first raids, we managed to get ourselves... Good luck. Oh my god! The... What? The, the Iron Man got a Twisted Bow. Since it was a free-for-all raid, that means that anyone who gets the unique item keeps it. So in this case, I got absolutely nothing. But that's okay, a few raids later, I got myself my own unique purple item. What the hell is an arcane prayer? Isn't this like one mil? 800k! Um, I missed the T-bow and get an arcane- Okay, I see how it is. I see how it is. Good luck. Purple in my name. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Ay, a Dexter's prayer scroll. 19 mil. Thank you very much. It's about time. About time I get something. There we go, 20 mil plus. After doing around 50 chambers of Zerk, I decided to move on to the Theater of Blood. And it paid off straight away. Oh, no. oh, oh there's a purple. Three way split, here we go. Come on, give us the sight and I can buy a twisted bow. Oh, 18 mil split, alright, I'll take it. Taking it straight to the dual arena. Kill count 195. Oh, there's a purple. That's a split. It's MVP. MVP without a sight. Here we go. Good luck. A Vernick defender hit. That's a almost 15 mil split for the Vernick. Thank you very much. I will mostly be doing money makers, which includes PVM and bossing in this episode. However, there is one money making method I want to try out and that's to fight skill specs when he's live streaming because it is common knowledge that he always dies when he streams. And we start off with a Carol DH AGS risk fight. plus beautiful. Wait, 12 mil plus. After killing him, we decided to increase the stake to a Dragon Claw risk fight. Hey, we killed him! 68 mil PK! Funny thing is, I made more from killing skill specs twice than 5 days of Chambers of Zerik and Theater of Blood. This is something I've always wanted to try out, doing bandos on two accounts at the same time. I've seen people do this for many many kills without even banking, so this might be fun. I accidentally deleted the audio on this clip, but we managed to get ourselves a tacit after three bandos kills. And we managed to get a total of 21 kills in the first duo session. Ew, I just got a shard. Oh, we actually got something. We got a hilt! How much is that? 8.2 mil, alright. Kill count 61. Oh my god! Final kill and we got Tassies! Yes! Another 27 mil to the bag! Oh my god, that, this was a great kill. We got a total of 58 kills uh, in one trip. Based on my collection log, we got a total of 140 kills for two Tassies and one Hilt, so I feel like that's pretty lucky, I'm not sure. As most of you know, I got addicted to Trailblazer Leagues, and if you go here to the Leagues Tutor, you can use your points and buy Twisted Horns. These Twisted Horns can you sell for in-game GP in the normal game mode, so we're gonna buy all of them. Alright, let's see how much profit do we make here. 28.5 mil profit. I'll take it. I'll take it. I think we now have enough money to upgrade our gear with a sight of Vitter. Can we buy it? We got a sight for 702 mil. This will come very handy for the theater of blood. This is my second TOB with a sight. 
Hey, a purple! We get a three-way split! Scythe. 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 Rapier. Oh, that's a big... Nice. What's the price on that? That's a 50 mil split. Look at that. 50.4 mil split. What a great split. I think we're getting very, very close now to the Twisted Bow. Five-way TOV incoming. Do we get a five-way split here? Oh, a purple in my name. First purple in my name this entire video. All right, all right. Here we go. Is this going to be the side? Here we go. Here we go. Jessica Schlegars. For they say keep it. 14 mil. What's that? Three mil split. Okay, they they told me to keep it actually. Wait. Oh my god, I forgot to. I forgot to take it. I almost did a Mika. It's still here. Oh my, I almost forgot to loot it. He got a pet. He got it. Farmer Lou, he got the pet. We haven't seen a single purple in 22 Theodore of Bloods. And we get a purple. My name, finally. Dry streak have been broken. 22 raids without purple. And here it is. We get ourselves a Justishar. Helm. All right, we gotta sell this just sharp face card. Uh, it's a it's a three-way split So we're getting ourselves a 9.1 mil split each another purple my name pulling purples MVP as well This is a deserved purple just the shard chest card for full just the shard. Let's go a Vernick. I'll take that Vernick 54 mil divided by three 70 mil each That's definitely not 17 mil 18 mil each 18 mil split meaning we have now surpassed the 300 mil mark beautiful 11 dev purple is this the one <gasps> no way we got 11 dev purple i mean look at the amount of devs we have 11 i got three we don't deserve this purple this must be a just a sharp piece we don't deserve anything else and we get a sanguine nasty staff a good item too I cannot believe that. I cannot believe that. 25 mil split. Oh my god. That's the most TOB deaths I've had ever. There we go. Thanks, staff soul. Kill count 240. For a purple. That's a three way split. Side, side, side. Sanguineness to staff three way. That's bad. That's good. What, what, why do I say it's bad? It's a good drop. He's doing the mathematics here. 34.3 mil. We are now above 360 mil made in this one video. It's a purple. A burning. And that's an 11.3 mil split. Thank you very much. Oh, PB. 16 minutes. Again? Uh, oh, no, there's blocked. no way. Oh, it's a purple. PB and a purple in my name. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Is this the site? Good luck. Good luck. Oh. A burning. <laughs> All right, that's back to back Avernic, I'll take it. I have tried a lot of money makers in this episode, but it just seems like Theater of Blood is the most consistent money maker with the big chance of obtaining a side drop from the chest. Oh, there's a purple. This is Avernic, he's oh, gonna be like, ah, oh, fuck. Thank <laughs> please. Avernic. Uh, yeah. oh, 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 purple my name. My name purple, beautiful. Is it my MVP? Not my MVP, not deserved. Scythe, he's calling Scythe. Just a sure chest guard. That's the worst item. Not that I really care about the collection log, but the only thing we need now to fill it is the rapier. These capes doesn't really matter. One rapier and we have filled the collection log. During this past month of making money, I wanted to challenge myself even harder. So I did complete a total of three duo theater of bloods together with my friends. Unfortunately though, we got nothing from them. And besides duoing, I also got into speedrunning Theater of Blood and I managed to get my personal best from 1642 down to 1506. But more of speedrunning in a future video. Uh, I wanna see a pet following someone. Ooh, I got a purple! I actually got a purple! There's no way. Yeah. Okay, okay, I'm dropping milk buckets. I'm dropping milk buckets. I've clicked it, I've clicked it. Please, okay, okay. not an arcane, anything but an arcane. <gasps> it's a good item. It's a what Kodai. Oh, let's go. Wait, yeah, it could Wait. have been a twisted bow, Wait, but it's a good... 
But that's a great <laughs> item. I mean, it's a great but item. It could have been. It could always have been an elder mole. The code I turned out to be a 29 male split. Beautiful. In this video alone, I have completed over 100 theater of bloods, over 50 chambers of Zeric, over 150 bandos kills, and even more than 100 corporal beast kills. But I have only shown the unique items where I got a split. So if we add all the non-unique items as well, I'd like to say that it adds up to an estimated value of around 50 mil. So if we add that 50 mil to the total value, we are now up at 480 mil. Kill count 298. Yes, we got it! Yes. Oh my god, yes, we finally got a purple. Oh, I'm just noticing that. Oh, that's what she wants. Uh -huh. right. This Avernic health split of 17.3 mil puts our total value at 493.3 mil made in this episode. This means we are only 6.7 mil away from obtaining 500 mil in one episode. And since the reason why I am broke is because of Zora, I feel like the only reasonable thing is to kill Zora for the final cash. From the first kill at Zora, we got a drop worth 185k. And that's the good thing about Zora, you don't need any unique drops to make money here. And after just 65 or 66 kills, we made ourselves 6.7 mil. The last money we needed for our 500 mil. This kind of video is something I normally don't do, so if you actually did enjoy this one, give the video a like and subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in one week.